Welcome to a new episode of Resolute Fitness. Today is Friday the 30th of July already. Crazy. Um, obviously, CrossFit Games have started now. If you're not aware, the individuals did day one, teams did yesterday. And today we have some more breaking news. So we, we have done a couple of videos, Carrie Pierce and um, Dan Bailey and COVID news and um, drug, drug, drug related news. But today um, we all kind of knew it, Cora Saunders um, has been struggling. She, she got COVID in transit on the way to the games and has been struggling um, on day one. She was down at the bottom of the field, obviously one of the strong, stronger athletes normally, and is normally near the top. But a um, husband, husband said uh, that she was struggling with some residual stuff to do with uh, her lungs after COVID. And then today, this morning, uh, this is about six hours ago from, from filming, it's like midday here, as I'm, as I'm filming um, but basically on her Instagram she said I gave it a nudge but it wasn't to be my health 100% comes first and after attempting a day of competition I realised that all it was going to do is send me backwards whilst my body is still trying to heal um, as always I sacrificed so much to be to be here even more so this year leaving my baby girl for five weeks I've cried every single day since I left. I got COVID in transit and now I'm withdrawing from the CrossFit Games after all that. And then she goes on to say, it's been an emotional roller coaster ride to say the least, but honestly, shit just happens. So many people have lost everything to this pandemic and I just didn't get to compete. So I still consider myself pretty lucky. Thank you to the medical support crew for having my back and giving me the opportunity to compete and for my sponsors for supporting me through it all. And thank you to everyone for sending me such kind messages. As always, good luck to all my fierce ladies throwing down this year. Enjoy every second. Uh, and like I said, that was, that was posted um, five, five, six hours ago from as I'm reading it. So yeah, again, another another one of the top athletes is is out of the CrossFit Games due to due to COVID, um, which is a shame. But she seems to be having like a, a good sort of attitude about it. It's frustrating, and you can tell that she's annoyed. But at the same time, she needs to look after her health. So um, yeah, wish her all the all the best. Hopefully, she can just sit back now and recover for a little bit, and then and then come back next year stronger. Hopefully this uh, pandemic starts to disappear um, and the Delta, Delta gets, um, we get control of, of that because again, it's a very frustrating time. Um, yeah, but I'm glad, I'm glad she's sort of doing, doing what's right and looking after, looking after herself rather than sort of trying to, to push through and something, something worse happening because um, health comes first, I think. It's the, is the main message of this. Um, okay, right, that, that's it. Again, um, like I said, I said in, in earlier videos, uh, normally I post workout videos. I've just actually filmed a workout video that I'll post soon um, and do sort of energy drink reviews, some, some vlogs, but during the CrossFit Games and the Open and stuff like that, I tend to concentrate more on the CrossFit stuff. So if you are not, on the channel you're more here for sort of some killer workouts and not the crossfit stuff i'll be posting every day anyway so just look back there's over 500 videos take your pick work your way through them um, but other than that yeah I'll, I'll be posting posting news about crossfit games i'm going to do a little video i'm actually going to film it now about the the monster drink so that will be here soon all right thanks for watching like subscribe much appreciated see you later